The U.S. dollar exchange rate witnessed a decline in the markets of the capital, Baghdad, this Wednesday morning, while prices stabilized in Erbil in the Kurdistan region. The dollar exchange rate fell with the opening of the al Kifa and al Harithiya stock exchanges in Baghdad, reaching 152,600 dinars per $100 compared to 153,200 dinars per $100 recorded yesterday, Tuesday. Selling prices also decreased in exchange shops in local markets in Baghdad, where the selling price reached 153,500 dinars, while the buying price reached 151,500 dinars for every $100. In Erbil, the dollar exchange rate stabilized in exchange offices, where the selling price reached 153,100 dinars, and the buying price reached 153,000 dinars for every $100. Today, Tuesday, Finance Minister Taif Sami discussed with the U.S. Ambassador to Baghdad, Alina Romanovsky, the government's efforts to achieve economic reforms. The Ministry of Finance said in a statement received by Al Mutala A Agency, Minister of Finance Taif Sami received the U.S. Ambassador to Baghdad, Alina Romanovsky, and discussed ways to enhance bilateral relations between Iraq and the United States, with a focus on economic cooperation. The statement added, the meeting discussed the development road project that links Iraq to Europe via Turkey which is considered one of the largest strategic and vital projects, making Iraq the link between Asia and Europe. He continued, the two sides discussed the efforts made by the Iraqi government to achieve economic reforms, where Minister Taif Sami stressed the importance of partnership with the United States to achieve sustainable development in Iraq, and to enhance the financial stability that Iraq seeks at this stage. Sami pointed out, According to the statement, that, economic cooperation between the two countries is one of the main factors for achieving these goals. For her part, the U.S. Ambassador stressed, according to the statement, the United States' commitment to continuing to support Iraq in several areas, especially in the economic and financial aspects, as part of the strategic partnership between the two countries.